And I'd been, I used to be a teacher anyway, I was an art teacher, and I was doing some research and I found this woman called the Tipsy Artist. So I thought, I, look, I watched it and I thought, I could do that. And then I thought, do you know, I'd be quite good at that. And I thought, I'll give it a go. And so I called myself the Tiddly Painter. Tiddly Painter, and there's, obviously there's alcohol involved, so that's yes. where the Tiddly comes in. Um, do, you, do you think that helps you create a bit better? Yes. I think that if when you when you're confronted with a blank canvas, I think it's one of the hardest things in the world to put pen to paper. But when you've had a little bit to drink, it becomes easier. And I think you just need to be bolder and sort of freer. And you know, I said before, just throw paint, just do it. You know, don't be too tight. Our aim has always been that anybody, any age, any sex. And feel comfortable walking through the door by themselves, having a drink, sitting down by themselves, talking to the bar, whatever they're doing. I mean, we have at Rothbury, there's a few women who come in by themselves with their books, yeah. and they sit there at a table with their book and a glass of wine, and just be with people. Mm -hmm. I think it's going to end up quite castle-like. I think I might give it away as a gift to somebody that I love. And they can it on their wall. <laughs> oh. And we did, was the it blush, we did the blossom tree last week, which was right. Um, How did you come on with the blossom tree? Was it good? Did, are you finding it easier or harder than this? I think I'm finding this a bit easier. Right. Yeah. But the blossom tree was more just like dabbing and that. Right, and, I get and, you. And I just like to get on with it. So the yeah. dabbing, it took too long. Right, I, I see. I enjoyed it. They're all up on the wall. I've got yeah. this is my fourth one. Wow. Yeah. Banter, it's all about the chat. Yeah. And this is what I find that's so important with pubs, especially little pubs. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the mental health for people. Because sure. it gets people out, it gets people talking. We've done beach houses, we've done a puffin. Yeah. 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 Um, I think it's because you're just slapping and all, it's quite easy. But like the beach looks, they were horrendous. <laughs> <laughs> Come, I'm going to make them a little bit bigger. I'm going to come down here, and I'm going to give them an ear going up there. Dead real artist, yeah, 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 yeah. Not quite. If you've got a flat head, which isn't attractive, you can make it a little bit more. Like mine looks like a sheep now. It's more the experience. Where I'm going with it. <laughs> when I said that before, I kind of just got the brush and was like, yeah, it really sort of brings it to life. Yeah, you've done you've done fabulously. How have you? I'm loving it. This is this is just it's so much fun. It's a great night, and you must obviously take the classes yourself from the night. You get the fullest element of it as well, and enjoy it. I love it. I love it. It's, like, it's a bit like a social life for me, you know. I can't drink because I've got to drive. 
unfortunately. But um, yeah, no, I love it. I love doing it. So it's not like a, it's not a fabulous job to have. And I love, I love art anyway. Yeah. So what a fabulous job to have. Exactly. Painting. So we've done all that. We've done the heart. We've got actually we've got a bit more on the nose to do. That's a bit tricky. But then we're just going to do the final touches, which is the fun bit. I, think. I can't wait yeah. to get back to it. So we won't keep you any longer because I know it's kind of time yeah. We're going to get going. Now, so I can't wait to see for the. Uh, I'm just glad you've had a good time. I'm loving it. It's really good. And relax as well, yeah, I would imagine yeah. it's quite relaxing yeah, as well. Now he looks like from Scotland, doesn't he, and not the salon. <laughs> what we want to know first is how many times have you put your brush in the wine? Oh, I know. Yeah, yeah. I've never tried that about five times. Really? You see? Sounds good, doesn't it? <laughs> What, what would you say was the hardest? The ostrich. Right. It was like the big, I don't know, but it's always, you can't, even up until the last moment, you can't, you really can't believe that it's going to be what it is. And then right. it just, like, all of a sudden at the last minute, just comes together. Wow. Excellent. With my little brush, I'm not using my big brush or anything, I'm using my little brush and I'm just making um, quite deliberate strokes. put yourself into it yeah it's just something different as well though isn't it something nice something nice well we'll come back to see that the end result what a fantastic night everybody's finished the paintings now have a look at them they're fantastic So here we go. I think I think somebody's I think somebody's come up from downstairs from the pub and they're gonna have a look at the paintings and pick one or two. <laughs> 